Hello everybody, Princess and the Baron here, and we are at home. Nice and safe with no masks. We got takeout from Aaron McKenna's. Yes. So we're gonna review those items we got. Yes, we are. We're gonna dive in. Be sure to eat sweets. You heard the girl. Sound effects. Ooh, wait, 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 before I toss this. Yeah, that's kind of important. Out of my shop. Anyway. So, I just like throwing things. We picked up five things items. From Aaron McKinnis. Uh, we have been there before. We'll leave that link in that video below. But there's far too many things for us to try all at once. So we went back and got you some delights. This is a cinnamon roll cupcake. This is a coffee cake. And then we have, this is the veggie, veggie bomb. bomb. Which we, did we get one of those last Yes, time? we did. And that is the brownie bomb, I believe. Cupcake. Okay. I got a... Stuck to the bag a little. Chocolate chip cookie sandwich. It got a little crushed in the car ride. A little crushed. Start with the cookie. It's all, it melted and got smooshed in the car. It made the trip by the world. Everything came out for the most part pretty good. Ooh, messy, crumbly. I didn't really get a bite of the frosting in the middle. It was mostly just the cookie. Oh yeah, it's way in there. Um, the cookie tastes a lot like those Enjoy Life cookies to me for the most part. So, I mean, it's really nothing out of the ordinary or extra special, I want to say. Not my favorite thing that I've had at Aaron McKenna's, but also not horrible. I'm going to blame it on the melty because it looks like, like the cream from one side just sort of melted out the side, which is why it's like all on top there. But I'm just going to take a bite from that side. Mm. I would say the, the cream bounces well with the cookie. It's the right amount of like cookie to chocolate chip ratio. Not the best I ever had, but for plant paste, I would say it's more than above average. Three and a half out of five plus. Why don't we both dig into this coffee cake together? Okay. Pink. Kind of the last time I had a coffee cake. I can't remember the last time I had a coffee cake either. Was it like espresso beans and like in a cake? I don't really remember what's in it. I don't really remember liking it either, just that it was cinnamony. Hmm. It's not usually all bad. Ooh. Mmm. Mmm. It's very delicious and moist for a coffee cake. It'd be great with a cup of tea. I love the texture and the flavor, yes. I feel like with a cup of tea or like a nice mild coffee, this would be amazing. Mm. I think the, the coffee cake is winning now. It's very rich and flavorful. I give that five out of five plus easily. I would definitely eat that, a whole slice. Next, let's do this cinnamon roll cupcake. Is that what it is? Yeah. Tink. Tink. Mm. Wow. It's quite a bit more dense than the cake. It's very rich though. Mm. Um, it's like a subtle cinnamon roll, which I really like. It's not too in your face, which makes you not want to finish it. Not like soaked from end to end. Yeah. I like yeah. It. Another one that would be really good with tea, I feel. It's, it's definitely good. I wouldn't say it's as good as the coffee cake. I give this one three and a half out of five plus. And now we have this brownie bomb cupcake, which is the cupcake, chocolate cupcake, chocolate icing, with a big hunking piece of brownie on top of it. I don't want to take the brownie on the top. I'm just going to take a little piece of the cupcake. Yeah. I'm struggling here. There we go. Pink. It smells very chocolatey. Mmm. 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 
it is a chocolate bomb, but not as overly chocolate as I was expecting. It's actually very well balanced. I like. I actually think that the frosting, mm. though chocolate, helps pull out some of that richness of the chocolate. So it's not too chocolatey. It like makes it balanced and perfect, like a creamed brownie. I think this one's a solid four out of five claws. I good. like this one. It's not as good to me as the cake, but it's still really good. It's really rich. So I know I probably struggle finishing it, but the flavors are like, bam. Definitely, definitely again. This last one is a veggie bomb. We've had this one before. So I'm just gonna split it half for you to try it again, though it's probably gonna taste exactly the same as it did in the past. Dink. I actually feel like this veggie bomb is much better than the one that we've had in the past. It's a lot more flavorful. A lot more cheese in it, I feel. It takes its bomb title very seriously. Mm -hmm. I'm still the same as I was in the video that we did. If you need a quick breakfast, a plant-based breakfast at Disney Springs, or even if you're not plant-based, this is the way to go. Because it's, it's nice and dense, it's light and it's quick, and you will not walk away unsatisfied. You yep. will feel full, and it will be healthy. Mm-hmm really not a there's no lose there you really can't even tell that it's vegan and gluten-free and all those other wonderful things so it's just not something you think about go try food. it even if you're not vegan i definitely think you that men as usual there's tons of fantastic options for all different taste buds at aaron mckinnon's it does not get enough love it's very easy to walk by it in between going from like say paddlefish to the boathouse but if you ever get the chance and you're having a sweet tooth or you just want breakfast you definitely stop it. Absolutely. There. I would say my number one is going to be the coffee cake. Number two is the veggie bomb. Number three is the cinnamon roll. Number four is the brownie cake thing, brownie bomb. And then number five is gonna be that cookie sandwich. For me, it's definitely gonna be the coffee cake, the brownie bomb, the veggie bomb, the cookie, and then last, the cinnamon roll cupcake. It really? was good, but this is just how I'm, how I'm running the day. Interesting, okay. Hit that notification bell if you wanna see other videos like this. If there's anything else that you want us to review at Disney Springs or Aaron McKenna's, the comments is always gonna be the way to let us know. And remember, we have new videos. Five days a week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Saturday. And we will see you soon. Be sure to subscribe. You heard the girl. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. In your dreams.